Hockey Heroes Clash of the Titans featuring Jock Plant and Terry Sawchuck. Jock Plant and Terry Sawchuck are two of the most iconic goalies in the history of hockey, each leaving an enduring legacy in their own right. Jock Plant was the star goalie of the Montreal Canadiens, while Terry Sawchuck was the star goalie of the Detroit Red Wings. Both were key figures during the original Six era. Both Plant and Sawchuck were instrumental in shaping the goalie position and had profound impact on the game of hockey. While their playing styles differed, both goaltenders are revered for their contributions to the sport and are remembered as two of the greatest goaltenders of all time. Jock Plant got his name engraved on the Stanley Cup for the first time in 1953 after playing in the first round against the Chicago Blackhawks subbing in for an injured Jerry McNeil. He won three out of four games he started giving up a total of seven goals and earning one shutout. Plant established himself as the starting goalie for the Montreal Canadiens at the beginning of the 1954-55 season. From that point on, he would go on to backstop one of the greatest dynasties in NHL history. During the 1950s, Plant played in 65 postseason games, posted a 1.99 GAA and a .923 save percentage with seven shutouts and won five of his six Stanley Cups. Plant also won five of his seven career Vezina trophies in the 50s as well. Jacques Plant is perhaps best known for revolutionizing the goaltending position by popularizing the use of the goalie mask. On November 1st, 1959, while playing for the Montreal Canadiens, Plant suffered a facial injury playing in a game against the New York Rangers. Instead of leaving the game, Plant returned to the ice wearing a fiberglass mask that he had previously fashioned himself. Plant was an exceptionally skilled goaltender. He possessed excellent reflexes, positioning, and puck handling abilities. His calm and confident demeanor under pressure made him a formidable presence in net. Plant won the Vezina Trophy, awarded to the NHL's top goaltender an astounding seven times in his career, and backstopped the Canadians to six Stanley Cups. John Plant's impact on the game of hockey cannot be overstated. His contribution to the sport, both on and off the ice, helped shape the modern goaltending position and left an enduring legacy in the NHL. Terry Sawchuk made his NHL debut with the Detroit Red Wings in the 19th 49-50 season, he quickly established himself as a top goalie for the reigning Stanley Cup champion Red Wings. He played in all 70 games, winning 44 of them with a 1.97 GAA and 11 shutouts on his way to the Calder Trophy as the league's top rookie. The following season, he repeated his 44 wins in 70 games and won his first of three Stanley Cups and Vezina trophies with the Red Wings. During the 1952 playoffs, Sawchuk went 8-0 with 4 shutouts, giving up a total of 5 goals in sweeps over the Toronto Maple Leafs and Montreal Canadiens. He won the Vezina Trophy again in 1953 and 1955 while leading Detroit to back-to-back -back championships in 1954 and 1955. Sasha played in the NHL All-Star Game in every year of the decade except in 1957 and 1958. Sawchuk won the Vezina Trophy, awarded to the league's best goaltender four times in his career, three during the 1950s and the other time in 1965. Sawchuk helped lead the Red Wings to three Stanley Cup championships in the 1950s, in 1952, and back-to-back -back championships in 54 and 55. Sawchuk was known for his innovative and effective playing style, characterized by his butterfly technique, which later became a standard among goaltenders. He initially played without a mask, which was common during his era, but later adopted one after suffering numerous facial injuries. At the time of his tragic death in 1970, Sawchuk was the greatest goaltender to ever play in the NHL. His 477 regular season wins remained the highest watermark for 30 years and his record of 103 career shutouts stood until 2009 when he was surpassed by Martin Berger. Terry Sawchuk was posthumously inducted into the Hockey Hall of Fame in 1971 and is remembered as one of the greatest goaltenders of all time. The rivalry between Jock Plant and Terry Sawchuk is one of the most celebrated in NHL history, highlighting the contrasting styles and personalities of two of the greatest goaltenders to ever play the game. Both Plant and Sawchuk played during the 1950s and 60s, a period when goaltending was evolving significantly. Their careers overlapped 
during a time when there were only six teams in the league, meaning they faced each other frequently and often in high stake games. They faced each other in memorable, critical playoff series in the playoffs and in the regular season, adding intensity to their rivalry. Both kept, both goaltenders are remembered as pioneers in their own right, with their records and their achievements standing as benchmarks in NHL history. Their rivalry highlighted the importance of the goaltending position and inspired many young players to pursue goaltending, shaping the future of the sport. The rivalry between Jacques Plot and Terry Sawchuk was more than just a competition between two elite goaltenders, but a clash of style, philosophies, and legacies that helped shape the NHL. Terry Sawchuk and Jacques Plot are considered among the greatest goalies of all time. Both players' impacts are deeply felt in the history and evolution of the ice hockey goaltending position.